All right, so this morning I'm gonna be wearing a mask because the smoke, I don't know if you can tell, is just thick and heavy. We've got wildfires all over the state, all the way down into California, Oregon, here in Washington. So I'm gonna wear a mask today, cleanly shaved so we can make a good connection. But today, we are getting ready for concrete at my buddy's place here. Not a whole lot of mountain work going on right now. So what we're gonna do is Make sure everything is uh, graded out level, ready to go for the concrete. Let's do this. This video is for my buddy Robbie Robinson of Robinson Hardwood and Home. Now my hope is even if you have no interest in concrete, you're going to find this video interesting. Concrete's one of those deals that we walk on it, we drive on it, and many of us don't even know the process of how it got there. So here you go. This is an overview of working with concrete. All right, everything is graded level with the mini excavator and we shot everything to make sure it was level with the laser. Now we're gonna compact it. All right, so this whole pad is gonna get leveled out. There's a trench that's gonna go in there. I'll show you on the plans. So here we go, lower pad. We're just wrapping up, compacting that. Here's the upper pad and here is the trench that we need to do. It needs to be a square. It's called a thickened slab. So you look at D, S1. Here we go. There's D. This kind of shows what it looks like. So this is what we're going to be pouring here. Holy smokes, we've got 153 subscribers. Guys, thank you so much for subscribing. Love having you guys subscribed. Love it when you send me comments and hit the like button. Still sucks. What are we doing today, Robbie? We're gonna we're gonna tie all the rebar, put the vapor barrier down, and get ready for tomorrow's pour. All right, let's do this thing. Concrete is super hard, but it's also very brittle, and the rebar is embedded into the concrete. The concrete is poured around the rebar, and the rebar holds all the concrete together. All right, got the grid mostly laid out. So now we're gonna start cutting some, what? Would you say six foot chunks? Yeah, six foot and some chunks. To, the, to tie these two together. All right, so we are ready to start tying this together, huh? Yeah. I want to see this fancy gun you guys have been talking about. All right. Is it really worth it? I think I think it is. <laughs> okay. I guess we'll see. I'll go get it. There it is. Look at that beast. What is this thing? The RB rebar. Oh, rebar tire. All right. Oh, rebar the RB 518. 518. There we go. All right. Only the best. Let's load this sucker up. Let's do it. So this is the stuff, huh? This is it. Slide that in there. All right, Robbie, what are these things called? 
pretty sure they're called uh, dough blocks. Dough blocks? Or adobe blocks. Adobe blocks. Yeah. So those go underneath to keep the mesh up, right? Yep. The grid. Ready for some mud. Let's do the mud. Tomorrow morning? Tomorrow morning. Bright and early. inspection already. All right. Life's good. We're gonna go get a power trowel, get the nice smooth finish. The power trowel like burns the sand essentially, yeah. kinda, right? Like yeah, steel, glassy. steel trowels makes basically a thin layer of glass on top of the slab, and that's what gives it that nice shine. Getting glassy. Yeah. All right. Oh, hardware sales. This is our favorite store, yeah. isn't it, Robbie? I think they got on the for us. Oh, there it is. All right. Oh, there it is, all ready to go. Do this thing. I figure Robbie's wife Samantha's gonna like this shot. Well, it's still pretty dark out, but it's gonna be pouring here in a little bit. Can't even see the pad yet. When's that truck show up? Between 6.30 and 7. Okay, all right, let's do it. Well, there you have it guys. Robbie's got his house pad all poured out and uh, he's building his house on it as we speak. To my loyal subscribers who've made it all the way to this part here, 
go ahead and comment below. Keep it glassy, Robbie. Why are we saying keep it glassy, Robbie? Well, because he's got this power trial and he's getting it all nice and glassed out. Now, if you want any top-notch quality work done, hardwood floors installed in your home or houses built, whatever have you, go ahead and contact Robinson Hardwood and Homes. These guys know their stuff. They're top of the line. Until next time, guys, thanks for watching Nateness TV. Just my life. <laughs>